is a beautiful day. This is going to be um, the first of many that will be coming your way. Right now, we got the crew traveling in the Hauser. I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, right now, right we're heading to um, Calamone Greens off of uh, Long Road. It's Lillian. Hi, Ms. Lillian. Thank you for allowing us to come to your shop and then go to your garden to uh, actually do a food shoot on location. Okay. You're welcome. Yeah. So if you if, if you don't mind, what we'd like to do is just walk to the shop just so we can see what they're actually looking at, yes. the products that are going to be picked from your garden. Most welcome. Most welcome. Yeah. Come on, let's go. This is where it all happens, all the fruit that you saw in the shop today. This is where it happens, so we, we're here, we're gonna shoot the shots of what we're gonna do today. Now, we're winging it because um, we're just gonna actually wing it, so we're gonna walk around and find something uh, that we can shoot. And today, we're gonna actually show you the setup that we're gonna be using. What we have here, that's in the camera gear pack that we're shooting with. Here, right, we have uh, two light stands. We have the stand for the reflectors. We have two umbrellas here. They shoot through, by the way. Music, of course, that's just me. We have batteries. We have speed lights. Transmitter. We have these battery packs. Now, if you guys are really into using your speed lights, I'm trying to tell you the truth. These things are the bomb. And then we have right here, we have the 5D Mark III with the uh, the 70 to 200 lens on it. Here we have um, our knee, uh, knee pads for getting on the ground, getting really grimy. And here I bought two reflectors because I, I wanted to show you one that's inexpensive. And uh, the one that I normally use is this one. But if I'm really on the go, I use this one, which is a Westcott. It's fairly cheap. It's like maybe uh, at, at the most um, uh, 1,500 shillings. So if, if you like really need a reflector or something like that, you can get, and I'm pretty sure you can get this in town, by the way. Maybe not Westcott, but you can get these in town to reflect it. So it's good to always have a reflector on set. Okay, folks. Now, this is called a thorn melon. And we're gonna try to make it look really nice and exotic. Okay, I chose this area because, um, just like I said, I wanted to make it look kind of like countryish and also exotic. And then here, I like this wood table. It looks like nothing, but the way we're going to shoot, we're going to make it look like something. We're going to make it look like a chopping wood block. Try and make it look really nice, and I like this area. 